Hello all and welcome back. Today we are going to design this beautiful fishbone diagram using PowerPoint. So let's get started. Before we start, let's quickly review online version of Wondershare eDraw Max. eDraw Max is one stop solution for all your diagram needs and is available on all major operating systems like Windows, Mac OS, Linux and even online version. Let's access the online tool by clicking this option and then on get started. The online version of eDraw Max provides a workspace for creating 280 plus of different type of diagrams which includes flowchart, mind maps, org chart, management diagrams like decision making and fishbone diagrams, project management, software development like UML modeling and many more. There are total of 2000 plus of professionally designed templates which are spread across different diagram categories and that is 3 times more as compared to Microsoft Visio. It also has total of 26000 plus of inbuilt symbols and that makes eDraw Max as the best alternative for Visio. Not just that, eDraw Max online tool has Microsoft Office style user interface and you can just drag and drop everything to create the diagrams very easily. All your works can be easily exported into different file formats like PDF, PowerPoint, Word, Excel, JPG and SVG formats. All the information and file transfers are secured with highest level of SSL encryption and nobody will be able to access your files without your permission. In simple words, you are the master of your data and your privacy is 100% protected. The web version of eDraw Max comes at an annual plan of just 8.25 USD per month and that makes eDraw Max the best diagramming tool. They also promise 30 days money back guarantee if you are not satisfied. If you purchase web version of eDraw Max until 2nd December, you will also get 1 month free subscription of MindMaster. MindMaster is another wonderful application from eDraw Soft and is used to create beautiful mind maps very easily. eDraw Max will be offering up to 40% off on Black Friday and Cyber Monday and this event will run until December 2nd. You can click on this banner to explore more exclusive discounts on all eDraw Soft applications. So try eDraw Max for free and if you like it, don't hesitate to buy it to get the best price. Links are available in the video description. Welcome back and let's first enable the guides and format the background with solid light grey color. Next go to insert tab and draw a circle holding down shift key. Align it centrally to vertical guide and increase its transparency to see through. Next duplicate this circle two more times using Ctrl plus D and align them in a triangle shape as shown. Align these circles in such a way that we have sufficient middle portion. Now select all three circles and intersect them. Next go to insert tab and draw another circle passing through the bottom two corner points as shown. Select both the shapes and subtract them. Rotate this shape by 90 degrees and that will be the face of our fish. Increase its size if required, make it no fill and increase the outline width to 10 points. Now format this outline with two step linear gradient and change the stop colors. Next go to insert tab and draw a line along the horizontal axis. Change its outline color to light grey and increase its weight to 3 points. Right click and send it to back. Now go to insert tab and draw a circle holding down shift key.
increase its transparency to see through and then duplicate it using control plus D. Align both the circles to get some middle section as shown and intersect them together. Rotate it slightly and align it at the end of line shape. Next duplicate this shape using Ctrl plus D, rotate it, reduce its size and align both the shapes at one common point as shown. Finally, union both the shapes and that will be the tail for our fishbone diagram. Make it no outline and format it with two step linear gradient. Change the stop colors using color palettes and eyedropper tool. Next go to insert tab and draw a line shape. Rotate it by 45 degrees, change its outline color and align it as shown. Change the outline weight if required. Next go to insert tab and draw a circle shape holding down shift key and place it at the end of line shape. Next go to insert tab and draw a line perpendicular to this 45 degree line. Create two more duplicates by dragging it holding down control key and place them as shown. Change the color to match it with other line shapes. Now duplicate this circle shape using control plus D, reduce its size and place it at the end of three small lines. Next group all the shapes together and duplicate it using Ctrl plus D. Flip it vertically and align it as shown. Next drag both the groups holding down Ctrl key to create another set of duplicate and then place them as shown. Next ungroup all the shapes and change the fill colors of all the circles. Select all the shapes and apply outer shadow effect. Adjust the transparency and blur values until you get desired shadow effect. Finally, add all text fields and PNG icons onto our design. Let's speed up to save time.
so here is the final preview hope you all liked it please don't forget to like share and comment thanks for watching and stay tuned